Brian Sowers of Yahoo Finance here, back in my big purple desk chair. I'm so excited to be here. Three things you need to know to get your business and investing day started right. And I'm so excited about these three things. I'm actually reading off my phone here today. Normally I don't do that, I just go off the cuff, but uh, my phone it is. First up, Goldman Sachs saying 90% chance of a government shutdown that lasts two to three weeks. They think it could trim almost two tenths of a percent of growth each week that the government is shut down. How do I read that? That probably wouldn't be good for markets and government workers who need that paycheck to live week to week. So that's the first thing. Number two, uh, Costco and Target. Target, first up, really, I, I encourage you, look at the story written by our very own Brooke De Palma. Target saying closing nine stores in this country because of rising retail crime. They have been warning about this all year long, but to hear a Target closing nine stores because of rising retail crime, wow, mind-blowing. And then Costco on its earnings call last night saying, they did not see a dramatic increase in theft, which makes sense. It's hard to walk out of a Costco carrying 30, a 30 pound container of mustard and mayonnaise, so I get it, but they are likely seeing some increase in retail theft, which is very interesting. Next thing, three, Marriott out this morning, uh, reaffirming its outlook for growth uh, that they put out there in August. That is good to hear from Marriott. Anthony Capuano, CEO of that company, leading the charge, but good to hear Considering we just saw a weak consumer confidence report, it looks like people are still uh, putting on their uh, bathing suits and going on vacation. And then bonus, here's a fourth thing because I just live that type of life. Coinbase CEO Brian Armstrong, exclusive interview today on Yahoo Finance with our all-star Fed reporter Jen Schomberger. Tune in, watch it, share it, everything. Brian Sazi, out.